back to my channel and vlogmas day 20. So today we're gonna have a try on haul that I filled yesterday. I'm gonna try this week to do a try on every day leading up to Christmas. <coughs> Cause I know that's what you guys love from my channel, cooking and try on hauls. I get it. <laughs> so we're gonna attempt that. Harriet's coming up to say hi. Harriet. Harriet. Anyway, we were supposed to have family Christmas yesterday and we had to cancel it because one of my cousins had a cough, went to Vegas, and when she came back from Vegas, she got put in the hospital with COVID. So I'm pretty sure she exposed my grandmother and one of my cousin's sons. Hey, get down. So we had to cancel Christmas. <laughs> Yay. So we're, I guess we're gonna do that in January. <laughs> and uh, Cody had made deviled eggs to take. We had already made all our food because they decided the night before at like 10.30 that we weren't going to do it. So I'm having deviled eggs for dinner. It's fine. Deviled eggs and soup is what I'm going to have. <laughs> it is what it is. So uh, I'm going to send you into the try-on haul and then when you come back we'll do the advent calendars. What you doing? Come here. Come here. You're just gonna hang out? All right, I'll see you guys in a few. Hey guys, so Cody fell asleep. <laughs> but I wanted to do a, a haul for you guys, a, a try on haul, and he can sleep through anything. <laughs> so <laughs> while I was doing my Christmas shopping for my family, I decided that I was gonna treat myself and just like buy myself some nice things so <laughs> while I was shopping at Walmart and Kohl's I picked up some clothing items for myself and I'm gonna show them to you guys and then we'll try them on so this first item is from Kohl's this my intention for this was to wear this to work it's a super cozy cardigan by Sonoma I got it in a 5x it's, they call it the super soft cardigan, everyday ease, comfortable and cozy, and supports more sustainable cotton farming. Well, that's nice. So it's, it's a pretty loose knit, but it just, it feels so soft. So there's item number one. So the second item is also from Kohl's. I'll do all the Kohl's stuff first and then We'll do the couple Walmart pieces. Um, this is actually by Lauren Conrad from The Hills fame. And it's like a waffle knit kind of thermal t-shirt in this really beautiful green blue. But it's also got these ruffles on the um, like seam, sleeve seams. And it even goes onto the back. So it's not just on the front. Um, I got this in a 4X. We'll see if that fits. I'm sure I can wear it under something even if it's a little bit tight. <clears throat> so this next item is by Tech Gear, Essential Gear. I got this in a 4X as well. It's like a fleece uh, pullover with this like crisscrossy mock type turtleneck. And I got it in this gorgeous blue, like blue stripey like a, a what do they call that a marled thing um the sleeves have a nice cuff on them yeah so this should be really comfy and cozy uh, most of this is like wintry uh gear so it fits perfect into vlogmas <laughs> all right the next item is a pair of jeans so these are also by sonoma goods for life got these in a 30 they have a button and a zipper, but they also have an elastic waistband. So I'm hoping these will stay up a little better at work. They were regular $50. Um, these are a straight leg. Uh, I know I didn't pay $50 for them. I'll have to pull up my stuff. I bought most of this on like right after Black Friday. It was like the Tuesday after. Let me pull up my order. 
Okay, so the Lauren Conrad shirt was regular $44. I paid $24.99. Uh, the cardigan was regular 50 I paid $24.99. The jeans are regular 50 I paid $24.99. The Tech Gear Micro Fleece was regular 30 I paid $9.99. So, you guys know that I've been sort of looking for like a denim shirt to wear. This is in a 5X, it's a, sh a chambray relaxed fit tunic. Um, regular $44, I paid $19.99 for it. I hope it fits. Um, it's got cuffed sleeves. Even if I just, again, wear it over like a tank top or something, I think it'd be really cute in summer. And then, This is the last Kohl's item. This is also by Sonoma. I want to say Sonoma was a brand that used to be carried at like Mervyn's and Target, but I could be wrong. So this one is a hooded pullover like hoodie. Um, again, in this like blue green color. It's in a 4X. So, okay, it's got drawstrings. What I thought was really cute is the sleeves are kind of like balloony sleeves, and then at the very bottom is this cute little ruffle detail. Can you guys see that? Oh, there it is. It's like a cute little ruffle detail. Um, oh, it's just on the back. Okay, that's still cute. I mm, didn't notice this though. It's an unfinished hem. So we'll have to see what that looks like. So those are the Kohl's items. Let me pull up my Walmart order. So there's just two items from Walmart. The first is a set of their leggings. I actually kind of like the Walmart leggings. I don't wear leggings as much as I used to, but uh, two pairs of leggings for $14.98. I got just a plain black pair, and then I got this super cute festive holiday lights and stuff and I can probably wear these to work with like a super long shirt or like a shorter dress and then y'all know I've been looking for a really nice plaid shirt so this is from Tara and Sky. it's a woman's plus plaid woven shirt um, I kind of like this color $16.98 um, I got it in a 5X. Oh, are those? There's a hidden button right here. So if you want it closed over your cleavage, it'll stay closed and not like uh, gape. So that's nice. All right, let's give these a try. I'm gonna wake Cody up and have him go out <laughs> and he's going to rain X the windows on both of our vehicles before we go through this week of snow and rain mix throughout Washington and Oregon. So looking forward to that. I was talking to Brittany today and apparently she, um, <clears throat> she almost like spun out yesterday or something because of the snow and rain after she had to work yesterday. So not cool weather, not cool. Okay, so here's the jeans and the hooded sweatshirt. With a cute little ruffle on the bum. I don't actually mind the length of this because you guys know I like longer shirts. But this one with a pair of jeans I think will be fine because it doesn't like cling, I guess is the word I'm looking for. And I like the balloon sleeves and it's really comfy. Now the jeans fit. I also just ate so my hernia is like a little bit out. But here's the problem. They're too, for me, they're too low rise in the back. Like these are my underwear. <laughs> they're just, they don't come up any further in the back. So I feel like, there, I've tucked my underwear in. I feel like they're gonna like show my butt crack. Don't necessarily want that, but they're, they're comfortable. Well, maybe if I can, Maybe I'll try to wear them not to work 
and see how I feel in them. And then I can wear them to work. Because I feel like they're going to stay up. They're not going to slide down. But <laughs> it's a little too low in the back for my comfort. So let's try the next thing. Okay, so I've got this chambray shirt on, which actually fits pretty well. I mean, you're seeing some gapping down here, but I would probably wear it like over a tank top anyway with it unbuttoned. Don't have anything under it now, so I'm not going to do that. But like, it fits my arms and it fits my shoulders, which is usually a hard part to fit. And then it's a little tighter on my tummy. No big deal. These buttons are hard to get. I could tie it like this and just be so cute. Like what? With some jeans, not with these black leggings from Walmart, which go right down to my ankles. They're super comfy, nice and soft, easy to move in. But I am mad at this. I mean, a little bit down here, but <laughs> this actually like pretty much fits. Pretty much. I think this close. And then here is the Tech Gear sweatshirt. Love this. So soft, so cozy. It's like a really light, um, super soft fleece. I think this looks great. I like the color. I like the neckline. I don't have any complaints about this, honestly. I feel really good in this. Okay, <laughs> moving on. So here's the Walmart Terra and Sky flannel. It does not fit my arm. The, the armhole is too small for my fat arms. But I feel like the rest of the shirt fits good, which is like super disappointing. <laughs> like, it's not fair. But again, maybe I can wear it with a tank top and not, I don't feel like I'm gonna rip it if I move around too much. What do you guys think? I kind of like this color. I think that's why I'm so disappointed. All right, so here is the Lauren Conrad shirt. I love the sleeves on it. I like this ruffle detail. I can definitely wear this to work. It's long enough. It feels cozy. And this is in a 4X, but I think it fits great. Let me throw on this cardigan. cardigan is gigantic and so cozy this I, I feel like I'm super giving like mom taking her kids to school vibes in fall winter I've got leggings like an athletic type shirt and a giant cardigan taking the kids to school I could be somebody's mom oh my god no <laughs> the perfect outfit would be this top, this cardigan, and those sweater knit <laughs> pants that I got from Dia. Tell me I'm wrong. Well, I think that try-on went really well. I was um, surprised that most of the Kohl's stuff fit. I feel like I'm really washed out. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> um, most of the Kohl's stuff fit. And looked really good even though some of them were in a 4x I thought that they fit really nicely especially like this one I was really surprised like you hear someone like Lauren Conrad who is obviously a thin person <laughs> and you're like she can't design for a fat girl this is really cute like I like this a lot I will probably wear this to work tomorrow no lie at all so yeah I'm really excited about some of these. A little disappointed in the chambray and the plaid shirt, but we'll get there. <laughs> Eventually they'll fit me maybe, hopefully I want. Anyway, <laughs> sending you back to future me. She still hasn't moved. Hey, Cece, can you come here? You wanna come see me mama? <clears throat> 
period. It's like, I'm out. Now they're both out. Cool. Love that for me. <laughs> All right. So I think we're on day eight. We are. So in the gummy advent calendar, we have red, white, and green gummies. And they're little gummy bears. I like gummy bears. Some of my favorites. Mm, someone was asking me. I got this at Target. That's where I got this one. The Dr. Teal's, I believe I got at Walmart. So day eight. Wait. Yeah, day eight. I'm so off. Ooh, a melatonin sleep soak with essential oil blend helps ease aches and soreness from muscle pains, promotes a better night's sleep. Well, that sounds nice. Lavender and chamomile. Mm. I do love lavender and chamomile. So those are the Dr. Teal's and the gummies. I'm gonna try some wine with my dinner. This is called Taste the Truth. Uh, let me see if I can look it up for you real quick. Taste the Truth is grown in some of the best locations in California for Chardonnay and displays notes of peach and citrus fruit. Its smooth finish is a result of abundant sunshine and a lengthy growing season. A kiss of allspice on the clean, detailed finish and rounded mouthfeel give deep and dimension to this vibrant, generously flavored Chardonnay. Two stars for fruit, body, and acid. Zero for tannins. Three for alcohol. Really? I saw you just push that off for no reason. So rude. <laughs> Tastes well, or t uh, uh, pairs well with hamachi, California rolls, so soft shell crab, braised chicken and mashed potatoes, marmalade pound cake, and baked fish. So it seems like it goes with a lot of light fare. touch my nose what kind of a wine glass why am I drinking in a bottle be classy it's really nice and light and crisp that's that's, that's wonderful it's wonderful all right I'm sending you off to a try or, or I'm sending you off on the day. I already did the try on haul for you. And um, yeah, that's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. It, it was a long day. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I love you guys so much. I'll see you tomorrow.